after spreading out this terrazzo into those four panels, we continue to the process of revering or screening the surface, where we use this straight edge in order to get a proper revered surface. Okay, let us see. So uh, when you just finish to screed or to revel our surface, the next step is to seed or seeding, the process of seeding, which is the process by which we add the marble chips of various color into white terrazzo. This is what you call seeding, where we add another marble chips into white terrazzo. This will make a pavement or those marble chips to be exposed on the top of finish.
after seeding our terrazzo, the next step is a beating. The beating is a process by which those expose the marble chips are embedded into white terrazzo or into white cement in order to make sure that if those expose the marble chips are just embedded into, into mortar. So after beating our surface with this wooden float, we have to ensure that if the all marble chips or all aggregates are fully coated with a cement binder. So this is the main reason why we have to use this roller compactor machine. This is what you call rolling the surface or compacting those marble chips in order to make sure if the marble chips are fully coated with a cement binder. When our surface is just completely compacted, we have to continue to the finishing our surface in order to find out a dense smooth surface. The tools that we are going to use is this steel float.
So we just finish to, uh, to find out our surface which is uh, somehow smoothed. What next is to wait for uh, 10 to 12 hours, then uh, we put water over this surface by covering this surface with uh, a PVC sheet or plastic sheet. Then we wait for uh, two up to three days for the proper curing. Okay? So when our surface became hard, the next step is uh, to cut off the surface or grinding our surface.